apps. Apps? Yeah, we got apps. We got free apps. Welcome to the Daily Appster. The short time we spend together today is devoted to iOS applications, either for the iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad. Not just any applications, but free ones. I'm James, and I sort through all the terrible application muck to find the gems you've been searching for. This is the Daily Abster for May 24th, 2011. The first application I want to talk about actually went on sale the beginning of yesterday, just kind of right after I put the show out, so I don't know how long this one's going to be free. It's called Fleet Master, and that's one word, Fleet Master. And basically this is Battleship. It's a Battleship game you can play against the computer, you can play against your Game Center friends, or you can play against just a random person. It works really well. When the game first starts, you know, you're able to place all of your ships. You can rotate them and move them all over the board however you would normally do it in Battleship. When you first start actually guessing where their ships are, you're able to drop five bombs, and then the opponent's able to drop five bombs. And as the game goes on, for that turn you only have four, then three, then two, then one. I found at least for the first game I played against the computer, it was kind of dumb. You know, it had found my aircraft carrier, but yet it still wasn't blowing the rest of it up. It knew where it was, but it it was kind of just going random. So that's not cool. But the fact that this has multiplayer support, that kind of makes up for it for sure. So check this out. Uh, Hopefully it's still free. It's called Fleet Master. Next app I want to talk about is called O-Ranger Park Finder. O-Ranger Park Finder. And I am a big fan of state parks, national parks, just parks of all kinds. I mean, this is exactly what it sounds like. This allows you to find those locations near wherever you are. It can either find your location or you can put in a zip code, and then you'll kind of just scroll through the activities that you're looking for. Say you want to go to a place that has great bird watching, or you want to go to a place that has spelunking, whatever it is, and you can tap on your preferences and then hit find, and it'll bring up the closest parks to you that have those activities. And there's a lot of information here. It gives you background information on the park. It'll give you phone numbers to call to make reservations. If you're camping, you can actually see the park map. Lots of stuff here. Pretty amazing. If you're into parks, check out O Ranger Park Finder. Next up is a game. This is a universal app, and it's called City Traffic HD Control Traffic in Six Cities. And I've seen a lot of games that are pretty similar to this. Basically, you have an intersection, and you've got cars coming from all the different directions. You're able to stop the cars, and you're able to speed the cars up. That's your two choices. And they're all kind of just careening into this intersection. You have to make sure they don't crash into each other. That gets very difficult very quickly. Progress to the next city, you have to get at least a, you know, a certain score. To get the last two cities, you have to actually unlock them with coins. And you earn coins when you play. So I'll give you something, I guess, to work towards. Not my favorite kind of game, but if you're looking for just like a real quick try and beat your last score, check out City Traffic HD. Next up is Photo Mashup. It's a universal app, and this allows you to create collages from photos that are on your device. You'll just create a new project, and then you're able to pick the photos that you would like to add to that collage. You can, you know, drag these around. You can pinch and zoom to make them bigger. If you double tap it, you can change the border on the edge of these. Customize it however you want. You can save it. You can send it. You can save the whole project, and you can edit it later. Pretty cool if you want to make some quick and easy collages on your device. The last app I want to talk about is called Groupon. There's Groupon, and then there's Groupon HD for the iPad. And this was actually another suggestion from Dana. Although I've used Groupon before on the website, I haven't actually used it on the device before, so this is pretty cool. And if you're unaware of what Groupon is, this is a collective buying power application. A business will say, okay, hey, we'll give you $20 worth of food for $10 as long as 200 people end up buying this. So you can buy this for $10, but it won't actually charge you until it reaches that point. And then you'll get this coupon that you're able to print out and take to that location, and it'll be worth, you know, that $20, whatever it is. So this isn't available in every city, but it is available in a lot of cities. So you'll just have to check the application or check the website for that. I use this a lot for food. There's a lot of other things on here, but generally my wife and I, it's 
it's food related. So if you're into getting really good deals, check out Groupon or Groupon HD. And that's all the apps I have for you today. You can follow the show and find links to all the apps I've talked about at thebigskillet.com. If you'd like to email me for any reason, you can do that at thedailyappster at gmail.com. And I'm on Twitter at twitter.com slash thedailyappster. Thanks to iCactus for the opening and closing music. Until next time, enjoy your free apps. Yeah.